kind of battling whether we should still go or not but our airbnb lady is like so out of like won't let us cancel so <laughs> You know we have a wedding to go to in a few days tomorrow's the rehearsal dinner is it a dinner tomorrow kitty uh, yeah. just rehearsal so not a rehearsal dinner no. okay so i guess just a rehearsal and then the wedding is saturday and then we're getting ready to go to new york which pray for us because we've been kind of battling whether we should still go or not but our airbnb lady is like so out of like won't let us cancel so we've already paid for it so we're gonna have to go just for you hater covid people trust me we've thought about it and we don't really have a choice like that's a lot of money that we spent on it already so and this was like m planned months in advance before all this craziness happened so it is too late um so yeah so we're got that going on and then tonight we're gonna make a roast again because apparently the clip the clip that i had for this for that my old vlog got like deleted that i made like this roast and it was so good and i wanted to share it with you guys but um the thing got the thingy got uh deleted like i think i accidentally deleted the clip but i'm about to unpack and repack and yeah Ooh, okay so just Blue, blow dried my hair and I'm gonna straighten it later. <sighs> Feels so light and nice. <laughs> I don't know, I just <laughs> like my outfit. I've got on my Titans platoon shirt from basic training and I've got on Kenny Bear's shorts because all of our clothes are washing including all of my like um, including, I don't even know what I'm saying, like all my loungewear, like my, you guys know what I mean, like my comfy clothes are all washing. So, yeah, I just got done blow drying my hair and feels so much better. I, oh yeah, for the wedding, in case you guys care, I'm going to be wearing these clip-in extensions. I've only worn them once and only for a short period of time, so... I'll let you know the brand and stuff if I end up really liking it. I'm gonna curl, curl my hair, so. Oh, I like desperately need a trim. I don't know if I've ever talked about this, but I was so desperate for a trim and my hair looks so much better, but like, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's so uneven at the bottom. It's like, I need like a big chop because I just haven't had a trim in forever and it just doesn't look good. Um. So I used these eyebrow scissors like a few weeks ago to trim my hair and it worked pretty well. I did it myself too. I looked at a YouTube video and which I don't condone doing this, but I did. And then I bought these scissors off of Amazon um, to cut this hair. But I was like, why did I just spend all that money just to buy a $20 scissors 
when I could just go to Walmart and buy some that are probably just as nice. They were really nice scissors, don't get me wrong, but I was like, why did I just buy $20 scissors? But um, what I should do is um, you know, leave it to the professionals and let my grandma do it. But she, you know, quarantine and all that stuff, not quarantine, but like COVID. And she's up in, a, she's like 70 something. So she doesn't really see visitors very often. But my aunt and my sister are actually cutting their hair this week or tomorrow, actually. Um, obviously, I live in South Carolina and she lives in Georgia. But, um, what is she talking about? My mother-in-law is like yelling. Um, so I can't like go and get my hair cut. But like, you know, if I say I need my hair cut, I need my hair cut because I hate trims, like hate trims. And I desperately need one. But yeah, there's my spiel on why I need a haircut. I'm waiting on Kenny Bear. He had to go pick up his tux because he's actually in the wedding to, uh, this weekend. Um, so he went to uh, into town to go pick up his tux. Um, and then he bought me some food. I've, I don't know if you guys remember, but I had like this seafood. Me and my brother had some. And I only showed like a little bit of it. And it was so good. I love the sauce on it. I like a really tangy sauce like I like, the, I like the traditional low country boil like that my family does it's a traditional thing like my mom does but I recently tried out this place um so um, we, we went to this restaurant or like this little place uh it's not an eat-in restaurant or anything but it was so good the the seasoning on it was so good it was like a garlic zesty garlic seasoning and you guys I, it was amazing it was really good so anyway Kenny is bringing me back some and I have been salivating over this for a week because my brother came and I've been like my brother came last week when we had it and for the first time and I have literally been like craving it ever since so he's on his way home with my seafood and hopefully it tastes as good as it did last week it's so good but yeah today was a pretty boring it was more of like a travel day you guys saw us this morning like getting ready to go my mother-in-law is here in town and we're pretty much just gearing up to we got this weekend you know the wedding and stuff and then we're leaving to go out of town on monday and we won't be back for a while so by the time you see this vlog we'll already have done this but um yeah got the goods he put hot sauce on it this time so we'll see how it tastes but i got lime to squeeze on top and some sweet tea 